Welcome back to the channel guys. I'm Louie, lit underscore taco 4x4. We're out here uh, at the beginning of the trailhead to back way to Crown King. Camped out here last night, got in pretty late. Drove in with Aeon, I'm here with my buddy Brandon. See the side right here, but uh, good day so far. Got up real early. Um, we have a few things in our agenda this morning. Gonna cook some breakfast. We already made some coffee. Um, as soon as we get done with breakfast, we're gonna pack up and we're gonna hit the trailhead. So, that said, stay tuned. What's up, guys? Uh, over here now at the actual Crown King trailhead. So um, here we got Aeon, he's coming up. Um, gonna try to climb this rock. Big sign right here with the CK. So I'm gonna guide him. Passenger, passenger. Not too much, that's good, that's good. Keep going, you wanna come up more? Turn, turn a little driver. If you want to come up more, turn a little driver. That, that's that's fine. You, you're turning too much. Just straight. Come on up. Go ahead. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Now right, you're sliding. You're sliding. You're good. This is a good picture right here. I'll take a picture of it. Aeon, we got Brandon. Brandon, you gonna try that too? <laughs> All right. We're gonna let this guy go. Yeah, it looks like he wants to give it a try, so I'll let him go first after us. All right. So here we are. We're gonna get started. Here's Brandon, trying to come up uh, Crown King Rock. All right, look at Brandon. He's gonna give this a try. So let's see. I think he can make it. All right, come on up. Turn on your locker. You got your locker on? Look at that three wheeling it. Steady, steady, all right. You're good, you're good. Keep coming, keep coming. I don't even need to gu guide you. All right. All right, slow right here, slow right here. Slow, 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 slow. Come on up. Driver, driver. Not too much, just a little bit. Okay, that's perfect, that's perfect. Okay, passenger now. Cut passenger, hard. Hard passenger, hard passenger. Hard passenger, you're good. Okay, cut it to the middle, cut it to the middle. Straighten out, straighten out. Straighten out. You're just three wheeling it. Straighten out. You got it, you got it, you got it. All right, hard driver, hard driver. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. All right, 
Straight on up. You're good. You're good. Perfect. Look at that. Look at that flex, bro. Look at that flex, bro. All right. A little slow. Oh, you got it, bro. You got it. Take it all the way. Take it all the way. Passenger. Oh, a little bit. Oh. Okay, drive, 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 drive. Oh. Look good. Look good. Here comes Aeon, giving it a try right here in the middle lane, the harder lane it looks like so far on the second obstacle. It's coming right up. Looking good. Looking good. Looking good. Driver, driver, driver. Okay, back up a little bit, back up, and turn it, uh, turn it a little bit, passenger, as you back up, as you back up, turn passenger, 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 not driver, <laughs> but that's okay, all right, all right, stop right there, come on forward, yep, you're good, driver, Okay, okay, uh, passenger now, passenger. Not too much, not too much. Driver. All right, just right there, just like that. Look at that, flex, bro. All right, uh, Aeon, uh, we're gonna have to two, two foot this. Give it another, uh, about a foot back. About 12 inches. 12 inches back. You're good, keep coming, keep coming. Keep coming, keep coming, all right, keep coming. All right, keep going a little bit more. All right, stop right there. All right, so what you're gonna do is go ahead and do the two foot. Put a little bit of gas on it while you have the brake on. Huh? You're gonna have to go driver, okay? Not, not right now, as you come up. Okay? There you go. You got, you, got, you got to commit after that. You got to commit after that. Yeah, see? So so do what exactly what you just did, Aeon, except after you, you hit that rut, you got to commit. All right, stop right there. You're good, you're good. Okay, do the same thing, but then commit. Give it the beans. Go, 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 go. There you go. There you go, brother. There you go. Come on up. You're good, you're good. Hell yeah. Hell yeah.
Super cool looking. Driver! Go driver! Alright. Hey, sorry, sorry, passenger, passenger. Hey, watch these uh, side by sides. Drop shots about the touch. Let's go back. Try again. Let's get a different line. If 
It's on your skid. You're gonna slide right over it. Still on your skid. Oh, it'll be fine, right? Watch this big rock. Hey, Aeon, that's probably gonna hit his drive shaft. Yeah, okay. Go back. Go back, Tom. Cut a little more passenger. A little more passenger. Not too much, not too much. Not too much. Little bit. You gonna send him over here?
going? Driver! 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 You're good. Driver! Driver! Man, thank you so much. What's he gonna do it again?
Yeah. Go, 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 go. Woo! Hey guys, so we're back out here, out in Sedona, after a day of wheeling. Uh, yesterday, uh, we were at the back way at the Crown King. Um, it was an eventful uh, few hours yesterday, for sure, out in the trail. Um, got a couple of winches out and, you know, got over some optional obstacles. Didn't take all of them, but uh, I took the majority ones, the ones that uh, I thought were pretty spicy and I thought, you know, um, I needed to challenge myself with. However, uh, there's a few ones that I skipped. Um, we were trying to make some time once, you know, we hit certain spots, we're like trying to get uh, over and it was taking a little bit longer. I would just skip out on the next few ones. But uh, the major ones, I, I think uh, I got through those pretty easily. Um, the last obstacle was a challenge uh, for some of the people in our group, uh, but you know, no problem. We got our winches out. Uh, you know, when you when you're kind of holding up a group um, behind you, sometimes you do have a peanut gallery that shows up and tries to investigate and see what's happening, and they try to give you all these opinions here and there about what to use what not to use, which line to take. And, you know, they tell you one thing. And so, you know, you become a victim of having too many spotters and, you know, it just becomes a, you know, a shit show, guys. That's what happens. But we got through, got to uh, to Crown King, made it out there about four o'clock in the afternoon. So it was about an eight, eight hour day in the trails. Uh, then uh, we got ourselves Aeon, so we were at Crown King yesterday, back way to Crown King. What are your impressions about the trail itself? Hey Louis, yeah it was a great day yesterday. We had some trouble on Crown King. Some of the obstacles, the ratings were I thought a little bit off. Uh, one of the ratings which was supposed to be super difficult turned out to be a lot easier. And uh, the last obstacle is supposed to be like a five but uh, I got hung up there pretty good and we spent about uh, an hour I think trying to get me out but finally we had to winch me out but yeah it was very scenic going through the mountains going through the slot canyons and everything uh, but yeah it was a slow day so uh, we're hoping to have a much uh, you know faster day we can do more trails today than we had yesterday but it was uh, uh, great to see all three rigs performing as per expectation. You know, we build these trucks to go and do stuff like this. So it was good to see that, you know, it was doing good for the most part. All right. Um, what were some of the damages that you took, if any? Ah, so I was lucky this time. I only, you know, took some hits on my rock sliders uh, and probably my transmission skids. Uh, so yeah, I mean, that's what they're for. They're gonna uh, take hits and save your truck. So I've got some scratches. I'm gonna uh, paint over them later on, but yeah, it was working as expected. Yeah, you were getting uh, hung up on your, your rock slider, uh, kind of like your frame right there. Um, I, I think you were probably about an inch away or so from clearing that uh, one last obstacle. Uh, we tried stacking rocks or whatnot. Um, it just wouldn't work, you know, because it, it was just that clearance. You were getting high centered with, with these Tacomas. That's the one thing, right? Our breakover angle is exactly. just, uh, just uh, you know, a little bit off and wish it could have been better, but. Um, yeah, I now understand why people, you know, uh, talk so much about putting 35s on their trucks because right. every inch helps, right? So yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. gonna do 35s in the future. Yeah. Um, Took a little bit of uh, pinstripes too, right? Uh, talk about how how that is, and as well as you know the clearance on the top, because you know not too many people talk about the clearance on the top too. Well, I mean, like uh, you know, pinstripes are you know uh, 
part of the off-road. Uh, you know, if you go off-roading, you're gonna get pinstripes. That's just the fact. Um, I do have a V-boost antenna that was kind of getting uh, hung up on some branches, so I've lowered it down today. Uh, but other than that, yeah, I mean, like top-wise, uh, I've got uh, like an up-top overland roof rack with the roam box on it, and I carry my uh, my ground tent on my roof rack as well. Mm -hmm. So uh, yeah, I wasn't getting hung up on the top at all. Uh, obviously, I'm not lifted that high. Maybe that helps. Right. So talk about also um, as far as the uh, you know on the way up there. What did, what did you think about like our campsite the day before? Oh man, that campsite that had character. So we were camped out right at the trailhead of the Crown King, and uh, I mean the campsite was good. It was an open spot, uh, quite flat, but we had a lot of bugs at night. Uh, you know crickets and stuff like that and then uh, all night we heard those donkeys being <laughs> like crazy <laughs> and every time I hear a donkey now I'm gonna remember Crown King that's for sure yeah they were definitely everywhere and you know you see their droppings even on the way up there too yeah, yeah. well you know it's their land we're just traveling through yeah and uh, yeah so it was uh, definitely a great trail Anything else that you wanted to add? Um, yeah, I just uh, wanted to add that you know, uh, you know, I've been building this truck since 2019 and uh, uh, haven't had a lot, a lot of chances to wheel them throughout the country. I've I've wheeled a few trails in California and uh, you know, in uh, we went to Colorado last year, but right. yeah, as you know, more and more. Uh, uh, obstacles that I'm taking I'm learning more and more how to handle the truck uh, learning about off-road driving you know obviously uh, there's a lot of money goes in these trucks and it's uh, reassuring to see you know it's performing as they should right you know? yeah you're definitely putting it to test uh, you know using uh, certain angles using certain lines and then you know obviously using our recovery gear as well putting that to use and you know, um, oh, yeah. breaking that in and making sure, you know, that if you are in a jam, you do have those things. You know, you don't have to try to break your stuff and, and try to, you know, just gun it and try to, you know, um, break your skids or, you know, or even worse, anything else like your <laughs> drive shaft. So, yeah. you know, speaking of the drive shaft, it looks like it didn't take any damage whatsoever. Not this time, but that was a big learning from our last trip. Uh, we both kind of. Uh, damaged our drive shafts uh, on uh, the Gold Mountain Trail in Big Bear, I think a couple of weeks ago. And yeah, that was the learning that don't rush through it, take your time, inspect the situation, use all the tools at your disposal. Yep. Yeah, so we put that to test. We, When we figured that we weren't able to get my truck off that obstacle, we pulled the winch out, winched myself out, and yeah, it was good to have that learning before coming here. Excellent. Well, thanks for the interview, Aeon. Uh, we're going to continue on with our trip, and uh, you'll see some more footage of him. Yeah, thanks, dude. And yeah, let's let's go. Let's hit some more trails. Sounds good.